Hey guys, it's Darren from Electric Motorcycle Builds and I'm telling you about a little hack that I just found out about. It is uh, how to convert a, a TV that works on 120 uh, AC to 12 volts. So we're using this for our new toy hauler that we just bought. Um, we're converting it to be a people hauler slash toy hauler and we're going to install a TV in it. And TVs that are 12 volt are about double the price of one that's 120 AC. So uh, there is a simple hack that you can do. You can just buy a standard television, a flat screen. There's plenty of them on the market. They're all about the same. You just take it apart, take the back panel off of it like I've done here. And most of these 120 AC TVs have a little port in them. You'll see it right here. This is the Vizio. This is a D-series Vizio. It has a small little port and it's actually labeled on the circuit board as 12 volt. So all you have to do is find the, get the right connector and, I, and I'm using a JST uh, 1.0 two pen connector for it. Show this here. So I have one of these uh, just laying around from other projects. So I'm using that little connector. I had to drill a hole in the back of this plastic part of the TV. I, I fed my, my line through and you just plug it into place. And then I did an extension here so I had a lead going out the back. Actually, I should have tied this in a knot. This will ensure that the cord doesn't go out the back. I'm going to take this out through, put it through my little hole there. Okay, that's secure. Now I, I will end up putting a connector and attaching it to these, which will be my power in. I'll go ahead and take the sheathing off those so I can test it. But anyway, after, you, after you've got it connected, you've got your dot in place, you can put your TV back together. I'm just gonna do a quick dry fit test on this. I'm just going to put in a couple screws here. Now, this is my AC, the 120 cord, which I won't be using. This is the new DC 12 volt. So I'm just gonna hook this up to my power supply to give it a test. So I've got that connected. I've got this thing powered at 12.5 volts. Take the remote. Looks like not blinking here. Yeah. Let's try that again.
ya. There it goes. Boom. It works. Success. So I think it takes a little bit longer to power up, maybe because it's running 12 volts, but that's it. That's all you have to do. And you've got a television that runs on 12 volts and you got it for half the price. So basically saved about 125 bucks. This original price of this was 125. So I think I saved about a, twice that. So anyway, hope this helps somebody and uh, talk to you later.